I'm gonna call it close enough. We're good. Okay. Actually, all right, right. cool. So real quick, real this is uh, Srom, yeah. senior edificer. May I ask you to reach him <laughs> to show him off, please? Actually, no, we still win. And is that CDC as well? Yep. CDC, the brute tyrant. And anime. Soul Wait, of restart, restart give this right. show no. another season. <laughs> give no game, no life another season, please. Yes. All right. Uh, would anyone like to cut? I would. We don't have to get this pseudo part. Yeah, we'll switch. She's doing right. Yeah, she's like, 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 like, she's like, she's like, she's like, she's like, <laughs> I like that. I like oh. that. All right. So, all right. Real quick. Yeah. Oh, man, Capable like, seven. Let's go. Uh, sure. Let's go. Can we work with this guy? No. <laughs> <laughs> yes. <laughs> what do you guys usually do for a, a mulligan rule? Well, we usually, well, my player group, we usually give you like oh, one, no, one free mulligan. Just to be safe, just and then for the rest of them, you just kind of no, blend the mulligan. If someone gives it reach, we want to make sure our creatures are big Fair enough. enough. I mean, this is, it doesn't matter for yeah, me. This hand's fine. I'll yeah, live. Fine. I'll live. It's an eight zone. So it will go to That's what you want to hear. 27. Yeah. Hey. Let's take a second. Fair enough. Fair enough. Um, we got some streaming going on in the background too. Recording and streaming. Playing uh, Black White I Eidolon? Black White Auras? What's the name of that deck? Saram Auras. Saram Auras? Saram Auras. Hey, Saram. Saram's like the MVP. Yeah, that guy. Saram's the MVP before today. Yeah. yeah. Hey, I've actually got a Saram deck in my in my box too. Yeah, <laughs> but that's Pioneer instead of EDH. One of these days, I guess I'll make one for EDH. It doesn't seem like it'd be too expensive. Like, play strong, play a bunch of equipments and auras. I mean, you've got the crucial power in 40 days, so that's Oh, that's fair. Fair enough. It looks like a different kind. They might not need to. You're right. What am I doing? I just cut myself. It's all good, dude. I can't tell you how many times I've done that. Golly. At least it's the weekend, man. At least it's the weekend. I will roll with this. All right. Dude, we off the stream team. It's kind of cool that we have a. Uh, yeah. Oh. Uh, I think we a, there we are. All right. Hey. Oh, okay. oh wow. Like, uh, <laughs> <laughs> um, <laughs> it's kind of cool that we have a uh, like we're already in combo decks and we can't take too long. That oh, gives the game a neat dynamic. Awesome. Uh, so Vivid Grove, it's going to come in with two counters. I will find two counters and pass the turn. Oh, thank you. I, I appreciate it. I, I will need a, a few, but for right now we're good. Say two. All right. Yeah. All right. I will put down and if I'm out, I'll crack it and pass. Force. Okay, come on. Good card. That's okay. I can live with that. Oh it's a fine card. Maybe. Question mark. <coughs> Questionable left decision. Uh, volcanic Islands. You're going to tap this for green. And play an Alchemist Apprentice. It's a creature that sacks itself to draw a card. Oh! Alex, Woo! That's it. It just sacks itself to draw a card. Uh, Pass turn. Yeah, this is why you're never. Wait, you know, <laughs> this is like it's draft not, common. <laughs> oh, wow. Yeah. <laughs> right. This deck would be very cheap <laughs> except for the land base. I think that's true for a lot of EDH, though. Yeah. Like, you, you've got it made. You, you play monocolor, you only ever have to have like one color, so you don't have to play expensive <laughs> stuff. Yeah, <laughs> that's, that's pretty much true. He has it easier. You're right. As right. soon as he plays that, oh, he's There like, we go, there we go. Yeah. All right, I will see your... Maybe I should. Well, let's see what I get. Yeah. Right. So Hostel's coming in. Yeah. Combat. Poke you for one. <laughs> I'm down, been down to 40. <laughs> Main two. I'm going to play an Ancient Ziggurat. One mana for any color, as long as it's for creatures. Green, blue, red. Anime! Oh, boy. And then, uh, pass turn. All right. And then, untap. Draw. I mean, if you, if you, like... 
I have a big down and someone in the background like, oh god, yeah. Jake's yeah. Jake's yeah. Yeah. No, this is the power yeah. down version. Yeah. They have to discard here. Power down version. Yeah. yeah. Well, like yeah, to be too. fair. Like Dark Stu and go ahead. Yeah. That's what I would rather open one. Well, 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 just because a some people might play, just play one. Explosion. Oh, that's good. Yeah. It's fine. When a quick creature attacks, oh, oh, it if it's a land, put it onto the battlefield no, tap. Get, nice. Get two life for turn. That's, that's, that's good. Okay. No. I like, I like it. I love it. You're not taking your ball. Yeah, so you did a face, and I'm sure it's dead. I guess I'm doing job seven seconds. Yeah, yeah. Just wait till Pure Steel Paladin comes around. <laughs> yeah. That's that's in the deck, right? Pure yeah. Steel Paladin. Yes. Oh, it's so good. It's kind of good. It's just busted. This one. <laughs> Let's see. So we'll start off with a. Uh, See, we're fine. Why are you gonna be so worried? I don't think we're fine. <laughs> we're fine. Oh, you're fine. See? <laughs> yeah, see you look. Just I know I, I know I am. Elvish Visionary enters the battlefield, draw a card. We're perfectly fine. Or not, not draw a card. Gets it, well, yes, draw a card and get a counter. This draws a card, this gets a counter. Cool. Got that. I know what I'm trying to say. <laughs> if I can just say it. Alright, we're going to play for one mana. A Soccer Tribe Elder. Yep. There's another one. Two. Um, well, I mean, this is a. We, play, we should play smart, but I think there's no reason. This is, this is not chicken string. Which one? Um. Uh, which one? Any, meeny, miny. I'm trying to think. We call the. We play correctly string. Well, the fact that I'm having to do math here should be scary. Oh, because yeah. it is. Oh, oh no. Um, oh, oh, this is the. Oh, please. Okay, yeah, we, we can beat this. Gaius Cradle. Ah, no. Makes four right now. Alright, I'm gonna cla cast totally a Cloudstone Courier. Oh. Whenever a non artifact permanent this is great. Can, uh, comes win. into play under your control, win, you may return another yeah, permanent you control that shares so a permanent yeah, type yeah. with it to oh. its owner's hand. Oh. So I have yeah, one mana floating. Well, so I've got actually, yeah, eventually that will be a problem. Yeah. But eventually, I mean, in a turn. It's a... Uh, seems scary right yeah. now. Just, you're not wrong. You're not wrong. <laughs> I'm trying to figure out what the right thing to copy here is. And I think I'm going to do something really silly. And I think I'm going to play a Phyrexian Metamorph, pay two. And make a copy yeah, of Elvish Visionary. This, this last, just last I'm gonna draw a card. Three. Look, we're fine. What does that mean? Yeah. So it does everything. Just um, we're fine. Swing four at you. Four commander. Okay. Four commander. Yeah. Um, and then yeah, pass turn. Oh, I'm gonna do this just so that we know which card it is. It's a copy of Visionary. Draw. I will put down a sunken hollow. Yeah. No, we got one card. Uh, then tap for four and I'll cast DC. Hey. It's Batfield, I mill three. One, uh -oh. two, three, no creatures. Uh, <laughs> okay, go ahead. <laughs> yeah. uh, I, I, we'll get there. <laughs> yeah. So only for sure we'll get there. Yeah, man, we appreciate it. Hope you're enjoying this. Uh, Play. Okay. Play. Hey, Look, I screwed up one power. Oh, first strike plus and plus one totem armor. Nice. That one screw yeah. cost us the game. No, it didn't. To be fair, it would be in a lot better position. Yeah, no, it would. We would have been able to attack with a 2 3 and gain two more lives, so we'd be at 19. What does that do? Uh, so like a the top five cards in my very main reveal a historic card from among them. Put it into your hand and put the rest on the bottom. You get Ooh, okay. Uh, artifacts, uh, legends, and sockets, I believe. No, that's that's pretty neat. Yep. Yeah. Okay. Oh, okay. Yeah, so <laughs> okay. <laughs> I like that. No. Yeah, okay. Holding it up like Yugi, like the like, like the two finger right? thing. That's <laughs> awesome. So, I draw a pot of greed. <laughs> Okay. Well, that's that's like a pot of uh, pot of desires. Right? No pot of duality. You kind of just pull, except that's three. Whatever. Who cares? <laughs> I love how, like, if you actually watch the show, they explain every single time they play Pot of Greed what Pot of Greed does, even though it's like the simplest effect. It's just draw two cards. 
Oh, nice. I never really looked at that in depth in Yu Gi Oh! Block here, block yeah. here, you still have a card. I've seen yeah, it, I've never looked at it. Every, yeah. 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 every yeah. single yeah. time. Yeah. I play Pot block, of Greed, block, which lets me draw two cards yeah. from my deck. Yeah. Episode 50. No, you're you're still time, you draw two cards instantly. Then you go, when he swings at Gideon, you go block, block, sack, disc, and this prop. Okay, you have another turn. I forget it. It's actually not Yeah. I can sack it into turn, so that's what I'm debating here. This is fine. Which I believe is what I'm going to do. I'm going to sack it I played this day. and get a basic out. Look, well, one, well, one damn mistake, okay? I'll get I'm sorry. any, mini miny forest? No, I'll get a forest. Yeah. In here somewhere. So, where, there you are. Alright. The now joys of... I forget how long it takes now, to shuffle. Yeah, now, 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 I shouldn't play a deck with so much shuffling. <laughs> I think that's the that's the secret. Oh, yeah. yeah. Oh, oh, Alright. Uh, uh, yeah, I think you got it last time, right? Oh, yeah. Whoever, whoever wants it. I know we were like... Alright. I think that. There we go. Yeah. Sleeves are kind of old, too, so... Oh, yeah. Now that we know that... Green bottom three. Yeah. You play this. Alright. Here we go. Here goes nothing. I think you went from mono green to green butt. No. Alright. We never oh saw God! Like, what's yeah, because yeah, he only had two lanes. We didn't see another yeah, lane. Yeah, uh, we bad for us, Ben. No, it's 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 bad for you guys. I'm okay. sorry. Okay. Um, okay. He's saying, "Oh God!" Uh, <laughs> no, it, I'm, the, I'm trying to remember yeah, how this particular yeah, combo works. Bad for him, not us. Yeah. <laughs> um. But you get no. So we're gonna go. One, one. one. She is one. She is one. Um, two. Actually, wait a minute. I think I'm supposed to go. Yeah, yeah. You have blue. You still block a seven six B stick. And uh, tap this for one, two, three, four. No, wait a minute. Wait, wait, wait. Not yet. Not yet. Uh, Pestermite. Pestermite trigger trigger. So this one is when it comes into play, I may tap or untap target permanent. So in response, I'm going to tap Guy's Cradle to make five green. And then untap it there. Yeah, and then untap it. So there's there's five green in the pool. And there we go. Alright, cool. But now it's it's this Cloudstone yeah, Curio trigger is out. So I'm going to return Phyrexian Me... No, I'm not, because that's an artifact. Uh, Elvish Visionary. And then Animar. I'm going to spend one of the green on Elvish Visionary. Go to four, uh, yeah, I, uh, and draw a card. And return Pestermite. So we're not at an infinite loop yet. But we're we're getting pretty darn close. If so I can just find the right the card. Oh, I'm not right. playing the plane first. Uh, you had it. You were hovering um, over it. Well, it doesn't really matter. Yeah. Yeah. No. This is this is this is wrong. So pester mine in hand. Oh, we're gonna win this. I'm gonna That's play Ziggurat. Like, this turn four. <laughs> five? Hey, I think it's five. Alright, so we're gonna, we're gonna do the loop again, except this time we're gonna uh, untap Ancient Ziggurat. And then do this, do this. Now I'm at three. So now we go at the Draw a card. Um, do it again. I'll go to two. Draw a card. Go. Um, I'll play a. And I forgot to do one of the triggers, but oh well. I'll play a Vizier of the Menagerie. So I can look at the top card of my library, and I can cast the top card if it's a creature, and I can spend mana as though it were mana of any type to cast creature spells. So now I think I go in for it. Oh, you gotta respond. Oh, do it, do it, do it. On Vizier? Alright, so the next time I cast a spell, because right now you don't have priority, but I guess when I do the loop, I guess like with the trigger on the stack, you can do it. So yeah, exiles. Alright. Um, well, in that case, that that's actually that's actually a really good thing to do because I can't spend Guy's Cradle Mana anymore because that would have been infinite because I could tap this for any colors. So yeah, you actually just kept me from going off, dude. Well, I guess I'll do the loop again. Go to one, draw a card. We don't know. Kind of knew what that was. Do the loop again. Draw a card. There's no green mana left in the pool. Uh, yeah. Oh my God. <laughs> um, so I guess I have to end with one of these in my hand, uh, unless I miss the trigger. So uh, even if I miss the trigger, the card I had will do uh, Gaia's Cradle. Make uh, five. No, 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 no. We should do one, and then Wall of Blossoms, and then Gaia's Cradle to make six in the pool. 
Alright, so go up to seven, draw a card off wall, and return, I guess, uh, oh yeah, I probably should have decided that before I drew the card. I guess Pastor Mike has already have a hand on it. Touch and go. Touch and go rules. Uh, any, meeny, miny, Mo, what's Brutalizer X Arc do? Uh, Search your light. Oh god. Okay, nope. You now I get to go into it. Um, oh, we're gonna play a one mana Brutalizer X Arc. We're gonna return Wall of Blossom to the hand. I get to search my deck for a creature, put it on top, and uh, that creature is going to be. Uh, um, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm all of the yeah. massacre. Yeah. <laughs> you tried. <laughs> you did what you could, dude. So, you guys have, they don't have nothing. Yeah. Yeah. All right. So, real quick, I'm going to. There, there's a couple ways I can do this, but the faster way is to do Oblivion Sower. When, it, when I cast it, I'm going to make an opponent exile the top four cards of their deck, and I get lands out of exile. That, that part doesn't matter. The, the point is, it mills you four. And it costs nothing with Animar because its cost is reduced to zero. Okay. So yeah, I right. take each count. Yes, yeah, yeah. I take Pestermite oh, and Oblivion Sower. Okay. Pestermite yeah, taps one <coughs> and then untaps that one and returns this to hand. And this one I cast for free and it returns one. Pestermite. Yeah. Uh, mill. Mill's all out for yeah. everything. Yeah. So yeah, basically take your Not entire deck and just erase. Yeah. Um, uh, you did. You guys did say you had to go team. soon, so yeah, I'm sorry. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> well, <hey. laughs> to be fair, with the exception of like Animar <laughs> and Phyrexian Metamorph, and the, uh, okay, okay, except for the lands, like everything else is like super yeah. duper cheap, like stuff you oh, get no. at That's the end of a draft, I guess. Mm -hmm. Well, no, no, Oblivion. So, well, no, you're actually kind of cheap too. You're cheap for a mythic. Yes. Yeah, I mean, it's, like, it's a bunch of like bad cards, but they're held together by really god freaking good cards. <laughs> Um, but next time I gotta, I gotta play Strong, because no. that's awesome, dude. Have a policy, I'm playing it in Pioneer, and I kind of want to play him in EDH, too. We, we were yeah, I'm sorry, you guys. No. Thanks well, for entertaining me. I know, he was entertaining just watching you. I'm sorry. Sit back watching the show here. You did what you could do. That actually kept me from going off the first way. No, he saved this and... Yeah, it was just Blue Fires or Exile. I was actually kind of scared that I was going to fail at that point because I kept drawing lands when I did it. And I could only play one yeah. land a turn anyway. So, And I saw the top card of my deck was a land. I'm like, oh god. <laughs> Not this way. Not this way. I think we wouldn't be able to do anything. Yeah. I wouldn't be able to do anything. Alright, so now we I I will. This was the powered down version of the deck. I'm, I should play something else entirely next time. I just need to actually go and put something else together. I just need to build another deck. That's all. No, I mean, we don't want all the deck. All right. Cool. I'll have a different deck next time, I promise. Cross my heart. All right. I'll hold you to that. Thank you.